on. Let's do Most some detecting. Like the lobby. They should cut their rates. Probably repair that. Keep your pants on, buddy. You have to check in first if you want a room. So come on, mosey on back, and we'll get you set up. Why can't I go upstairs? What's going on up there? <gasps> oh, <laughs> you. I work here, okay? Beauty! It's to help pay rent. So, now you know. I know I should have told somebody. But Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beast is a proud man, Bigby. He wants to do right by me, and he, he just couldn't handle it if he knew I had to do this so we don't get evicted. All of our friends live at the Woodlands. He'd be mortified. Well, your secret's safe with me, all right? Let's not make a big thing. She's just working thanks, his big B. job. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. So, what are you doing just here? Just don't be in any deeper than you already are, Missy. Oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh. Oh, yes. The, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad intimidating. Ever see Lily with someone here? Maybe on a job? Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Smith. <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last ones are jokes. Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't snow and went about my business. I talked to Tweedledee earlier today. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him or his brother? I took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money. Well, Plus that was interest. the dumbest decision you ever made. Why? Yeah, two. why those two? It was from the crooked man. Beauty. You don't know how desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look, if this ever happens again, come see me or Snow first, alright? Yeah, Jesus. I tried. What? Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather. Sorry. Thanks. Wait. It'll be better if anyone sees you, that they at least see you with me. So they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. No, it won't. What if your Five husband minutes. sees yeah. us? We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. If your husband saw us like that, then... He would flip. He'd, like, shady hotel, us two, come on. Listen, Bigby, I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something. Which is fine, it's just that I was wondering if... I need to be in it. Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just... You're asking me to lie. Not lie, just not include my name. Just say you talk to the clerk or something. You'll do what you have to. I just want you to know that that would help me. Well, here we are. Which one was it?
You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. You have to let me in there. This is the room, 207. But I... This is the room Lily was in. Oh, fine. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, oh, shit. Beast? Beauty? <laughs> How could you do this to me? No, sweetie, no. Wait a minute. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I, I told you. you this was I a bad idea. Please. I told you this You're was a bad idea. On me with him? No, no, Beast. I promise. I told you this would look I'm bad. Him. That's all. I'll bet. I'm sure you help each other just great. I know what this place is. This is a murder investigation. She's helping me. Stop lying to me. <sighs> what the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife. Beast, listen to me. There's nothing going on. I'm mad. Hey. Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are. Stop. Stop it. Is this you staying out of it? I thought I could trust you. We don't have to do this. Just calm down and... Beast! What the hell? I don't want to fight him! You aren't even listening to me! Beast, I really... I told you! Just stop! Stop! I don't want to fight him. No! I'm not fighting him. I wonder what happens if I just don't fight him. Oh, game over. Alright, yeah. That's shit. I don't want to fight Beast. Wow, don't be a fucker. <gasps> if you hurt beauty, I am going to She's sing. my fucking wife! Oh well, at least we're in the room, eh? <sighs> did to the door you can't just act like this whenever Stand you back you you don't want to see this well we got the door open <gasps> oh my god don't touch anything is this is this lily met her client here mr smith whoever he is and then must have happened right here well i say so last night? yeah i was on shift last night on shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work at the front desk. I... so that's... Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay?
Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. Put on the sunglasses. <sighs> Let's do this. Do you smell something? No. Just apple. Oh dear. Well, that's a connection to Snow White if I ever bloody saw one. Storybook. Um, ashtray. Bottle. Cassette. Oh! We shouldn't even be in here. Bigby, this? I think I heard this music. Last night, it was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. Where'd you get that? Lily had it in her hand. In case there was any doubt over who died here. <sighs> what is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Mundy version of her story, anyway. Okay, that's two connections to Snow that we've got here. The whole book is about her? Yeah. Huh. What is it? Apple. I think the apple is part of his fantasy about Snow White. That would explain the one we found on the floor. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled it. <laughs> I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course, that makes perfect sense. They were acting out the thing with her stepmother and the apple, which is really creepy when you think about it. You know, she almost died when... Uh... Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no, what? What is it? I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers, too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to kiss her. That's our Mr. Smith. This is just bizarre. This guy really has a thing about snow. It's like pathological. I'm getting that feeling. Shit. Why was Beast here? Poor girl. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. Why was Beast here? She wind up here. I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person... We can't know the answer to that. Every situation is different. I want to know yeah. why your fucking husband was here. She must have been so scared. Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no, she must have been wearing it. He killed her and then, and then he took it back off? 
Well, he glamoured her no, to look no like it. It snow. Must have been torn some other time. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. It's another match to what's in the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in the snow white dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. <laughs> so you Why are you sucking up to me so much? Down. Only then when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up. Yeah. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. of the dead girl? Not all of them. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Bigby. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand-in for snow is gone now, so... The next step closer. What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. Fuck. Don't smash the mirror, you bloody idiot. Well, that was dark as shit. could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting weasel. I'm really starting to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. Hello, Big B. Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? 